Hey guys, Tachi here. Um, hope you have enjoyed video one on SEO prospecting. Today we are going to discuss the other two prospecting methods that we use in our digital marketing agency. And in tomorrow's video, the final video, we are going to uh, discuss how to automate everything and get unlimited high quality uh, leads. So let's hop onto my computer again and discuss the last two prospecting methods. Hey guys, uh, welcome back. In yesterday's video, we have discussed Yelp and not mobile friendly prospecting method. And in today's video, we are going to discuss uh, two more prospecting method, uh, page two and Google Maps method. You see, if your business is not on Google, um, then there is a problem. You know, you want your um, business to be on Google Maps. Okay, so you want your business to be on Google Maps. So if you go and search for any keyword in your city, for example, domestic services in Louisiana, you will see that, you know, I've found uh, four to five uh, businesses on page two that are not um, on, on Google Maps. So what I've done is I've just taken a note of all the sites. Uh, so let me take this first one here. And if I just put in here, you will see that, you know, um, few of these businesses are not on um, Google Maps. So you see this, this one is not on Google Maps and uh, this one is available on Google Maps. So you know there is a lead and you know you can contact them and, and you know help them uh, solve this problem, get their business on uh, Google Maps and it's, it's pretty simple you know it will not take more than uh, 10 to 15 minutes to get their um, business on uh, Google Maps. So I'm not getting in uh, detail like you know how you do this it's just a, a video series about uh, prospecting we will get into that in a later video so as you can see you know uh, just like that we have um, so many sites you will find that are not available on uh, Google Maps so that's the third prospecting method that we use to pull up leads and last and final method that I want to discuss about is uh, page two method. So I call this page two because normally what happens, the, business, the people, the businesses that are on page two, page three, and page four, they want to get on uh, page one. So, you know, if you could somehow approach them and, and give them value like I said yesterday, value comes first and then later you upsell them your services so yeah this is a very short video guys i don't want to make this a uh, very long so you know uh, th that's the la there's the last final prospecting method that we use it's called page two method what we do normally is you know we go to page two page three and you know up to page seven and eight and then take down the businesses details that are not on page one you know they are not on page one yet so we approach them you can either uh uh, provide them a service where you convince them because you know it's very hard to convince a business um, uh, because you haven't um, gained their trust yet so you know what what we normally do is you know we tell them hey we would rank you on page one and you pay us after after you you get page one ranking on page two ranking so whatever their goal is so you know that that's um, that that's gonna be a win-win situation for you because you're trying to build a trust and then you know they they do not have uh, to invest anything to get on page one so that's just one strategy that we use you can again you know think about how you can uh, give them value and uh, contact this business so today we have uh, completed four yesterday two and two today we have completed two more prospecting methods guys and in uh, tomorrow's video I'm going to show you a cool software that can automate all this for you so make sure you watch video 3 um, you know to, to make this faster for you right now you know you have to go through all the sites step by step and you know how about if, if you have a software that does all this for you you know uh, it will find negative <coughs> Yelp review sites for you it will find page two page three page uh, four sites like this one I've showed and then it will find sites that are not on Google Maps and the fourth one is uh, not mobile friendly sites. so that's 
uh, will be discussed in tomorrow videos uh, thank you so much again for uh, watching this video see you tomorrow thanks